Well, I, I just happened to meet uh, Alyssa Harley. And Alyssa is a, someone who knew Sylvia Rivera as I did. Sylvia was a very dear friend of mine. And tell me about, there's a street name for her. The Sylvia Rivera Way. And down at Hudson and Christopher Hudson and Christopher, that's correct. And then, so on Pride Day, what we've done is gone down and covered her pole with flowers and pictures of her and messages saying how much we love her and miss her. That's so wonderful to know. And we want everyone to know that. We don't want to, like... We want all the tourists to come in and remember Sylvia. I, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to publicize that on YouTube, if I may. You may. Because, because you know, I had another interview with a, a very heavy African-American trans filmmaker who just talked about meeting Sylvia once and how she touched him. She had a way of really inspiring people in a very wonderful fashion. Absolutely. Very much. I knew her for the last year and a half of her life. and When she was working in a homeless kitchen, Absolutely. serving I food. go up there and help her. And, uh, and she had quit drinking and she had a really everything. Finally, this Sylvia had gotten her whole life together, and then that so liver fun. gave out from all the drinking she'd done over and the after, years. After she died, she, you know, and I'm in a bad situation, I'll, I'll put her on my shoulder and just get fierce. You know, you know something interesting? Uh, when she died on her deathbed, she said to Hunter James, who's a friend of mine, you may know her as a little different name uh, Sylvia asked her please take care of Julia Murray I remember um, I've taken Julia Murray in for a few weeks le recently but she's very hard to live with because she's such a she, eat, she eats too much and she's an utter pig and I'm a pig to begin with so I mean I take her in I, she's always welcome in my house temporarily right I've said a lot of prayers for her yeah yeah. She's a very sweet, very wonderful, very innocent and, and trusting person. You know, I can see what Sylvia saw in Julia. Julia, as a matter of fact, in one of my videos called Patriotic Transgender Fashion, and Transgender Fashion is Born. <laughs> uh, yeah. hot, hot, sexy, and unisex. Transgender Fashion is Born. Send me the email, and I'll send you the links. It's on YouTube, and it's surprisingly, it's a really a long, rather boring. I mean, I made it. I was just sitting with a camera and had Julia gluing this flower on a hat. And, you know, I had her holding this flower, and I suddenly realized we hadn't read the instructions. How long are you supposed to hold the flower? And I was sort of like making jokes. You know, you might be holding it till sunset. And it goes on and rambles on a bit. And, and anyway, it, it was a point where I really sort of changed, decided to reinvent myself. You know, that to free people, I used to see men that were always dressed in ugly browns, blacks, and blues. I call it a triangular prison, male, blue, and women tied up in pink ribbons, the uncomfortable high heel shoes. And I think if you want to wear, be that way, fine. But, you know, to me, I that's... I wore rainbows to her funeral. Well, I mean, I, I think... She I think, said that. She said what? She said, come, come in lots of colors. Oh, really? Yes, she did. You know, she was in the, in, the, in the coffin with the Marsha P. Johnson button on, and that's... Marsha was the house mother of my extended gay family. I wish I, I'd never met Marsha. I was too young for that. You know, I was really luckier than you because I knew them both. But you were lucky to have known Sylvia. I was lucky to have known Sylvia. I was very blessed to know her. Yeah. Very blessed. And remember, on Gay Pride Day at the corner of Christopher Street and Hudson, there's a sign up that says Sylvia Rivera Way. And when you tourists come to New York City for the big gay pride event, I hope you'll join all of us in putting flowers and remembrances to Sylvia Rivera there on the lamppost that bears the name Sylvia Rivera Way right under Hudson Street. Thanks. This is Randy Wicker reporting from Trans Day of Remembrance in New York City. Thank you for watching. Please rate and comment. Thanks, Randy.